What's going on guys, Nick Zapper World here. And today guys, I'm gonna be showing you how to dual boot with Cool Booter. So first, you'll obviously need to be jailbroken. I'm jailbroken on iOS 7.1.2 on an iPhone 4 GSM. So first you wanna open Cydia. Wait for it to load. And then you wanna to go to sources. Oh, reloading data. You want to go to sources, edit, add, then you want to add this source, cool boo.com, cool, so coolbooter.com, I'll leave it in the description below, hit add source, let it verify, let it load. Just let it do its thing, it shouldn't take very long. Should be done just about now. Hit, yep, return to Cydia. So go, next, go into the source, go into all packages, and tap the top on Cool Booter. Hit modify and install. This should take about two minutes. I'll come back when this is done. Once Cool Booter finishes installing, you wanna hit return to Cydia. Then you want to go to the home screen, and Cool Booter should be there. You want to open it up. You will get this warning telling you to back up your device, but you don't have to. Then you want to hit install. Then you have all these versions to pick from, from 5.0 all the way up to 7.1.2. So I'm going to pick 6.1. So I'm. Then you want to hit storage. Pick how much storage you want. I'm going to say 4 gigs. I'm going to hit select. Then you want to hit I'm ready. Then it's going to ask you if you want to do a custom boot logo. I'm going to say no. Now it's going to ask you if you want to do verbose boot, which is just a bunch of text coming down your screen as the iPhone boots up into iOS 6. I'm going to say yes. And I would like to jailbreak. Now it's just going to download iOS 6 from Apple, and I'll get back to you when this finishes up. So it has finished downloading and installing. It took about 15 minutes. And now it's asking us to reboot, so we're going to tap reboot. We're going to let the phone reboot, and I'll be back when it reboots. So the phone just rebooted, and now we're going to slide to unlock. We're going to swipe, go back into Cool Booter, and now we're going to hit boot. It says booting iOS 6.1. Now it's asking us to lock our device. You want to wait about 10 seconds, then we're going to press the home button or the power button, up to you. I'm going to push the home button. So about a few more seconds. Now you can push what button you chose, and there we go, the old school iOS 6 Apple logo. Here's the verbose boot. We're gonna let it do its thing. Shouldn't take that long. It's gonna not take 15 minutes like the last process. It's gonna take about maybe max five minutes, and I'll be back once I'm at the iOS 6 setup screen. After the verbose boot, you will see the Apple logo and a loading bar. So if you see this, that is a good sign and that means everything is going perfect. See, it shouldn't take long, it's already finished up. Now we're back to verbose. And now it's gonna be booting to the setup screen. Give it a moment, let it do its thing. So it didn't take five minutes, it took maybe Two minutes. And now here we are back at the iOS 6 setup screen. So we're going to slide to setup. I'm going to pick English, Canada. Choose a Wi Fi network, but I'm going to skip this part and I'll meet you guys back at the iOS 6 home screen. I'm now done setting up the iPhone, so I'm going to tap start using iPhone. And here we are back at the iOS 6 home screen with Cydia jailbroken. So I'm going to go into settings and confirm we are on iOS 6.1. As you can see, iOS 6.1, and we have d now dual booted iOS 6 and iOS 7. So if you like my video, leave a thumbs up, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all later.